It's Vlogmas J19. Freaking 19. It is 9 18 in the morning. Um, right now I'm about to get dressed and I'm about to run to the hair store. Like I told y'all, I am going to be dyeing my hair back black. So I made the decision. Yes, I'm gonna go back black. I don't know why, like healthy hair just flourishes when it's black so yeah i'm about to go dye my hair black so i'm about to get up go to the beauty spa store and do that my appointment is actually not until after christmas but i just want to get it started like i'm really ready to i'm really ready for this like hair growth journey like the next two years is gonna be lit like lit. and i'm gonna be documenting it this time because when i grew my hair out the last four years i went two years no heat and then i finally did a link check but i wasn't getting trims like i should so for the next two years i'm definitely gonna be keeping up with that and recording that and a lot of my stuff that i ordered for my hair hasn't came in my hair oil has came in but the other two sets of things that i ordered for my hair hasn't came in so that's why i haven't been talking about that but hopefully they are on the way but yes i'm about to get up and we're about to go to the hair store and start the day. Oh yes, I am back already. Like thankfully it is down the street. And they actually gave me a premium. I don't think I'm gonna use it because I don't wear this short over here. Like I don't know. The first 200 customers got free gifts. And that was the free gift. But this is what your girl went in for. Got two of these in the jet black oh that's not the only there it go <laughs> jet black so this is what i'm about to get into right now um like i said it was down the store i mean kind of down the store it was down the street so it was quick it is 9 41 and i left the house at like 9 20 so yeah i got that i got some more bundles which i probably won't be using but yeah i'm about to go do that now do this head and we'll see how we looking afterwards all right y'all this is it say goodbye to the orange i've definitely learned my lesson um if you want to color your hair get a wig don't mess up your real hair i'm really gonna miss this color but it ain't worth the health of my hair and um, if y'all ain't heard my boo new album hold on there we go if y'all ain't heard my boo new album, then go, then go stream it. Go stream it. I love DC Young Fly. If you don't know, now you know. I love DC Young Fly. He don't know we together, but I know we together. We have, we actually have the same birthday. We are both born on the same day. So, we was meant to be. But yeah, stream that if you haven't already. Okay, y'all. I'm on my way to go babysit. It is like 1.47. Yes, I spent all morning doing my hair. I, um, underneath, of course, um, I dyed it all jet black and put a protein treatment on it. And now I have a deep conditioner sitting on it. And I don't know how I feel about it. It's kind of a little bit better, but I just can't wait to get my hair done, get it back healthy, and, you know, get on this road to health. So, yeah. So I'm on my way to go babysit. Um, I have something, well, what I had planned for yesterday, I want to do tonight. So this video might be uploaded a little later, but yes, I do still plan on doing that. Okay, y'all, so my camera did die, so I am on my phone, but today I'm going to actually be answering the most asked question that I get, because y'all ask me all the time, how did I go? from being a MA to a PCA, did I go back to school? Did I do any of that? And literally, no, I am not, not saying it's like bad or anything, but I would not spend anything extra other than trying to get this RN that I'm getting like, your girl is tired. I'm not gonna get anything extra. I'm trying to get what I need to get right now and finish, but no, answer your question no i did not go back to school to be a pct 
I simply believe my three years as an MA is what got me into being a PCT. I have <laughs> you want to be in my video? <laughs> I have the um experience pulled up so I am going to read that off and tell y'all about it and she just wants to be in my video you gonna tell the people hi tell them hi So I'm gonna read y'all off the experience of what my job wanted. And yeah, this is all I had to do to get the job. I'm supposed to be making a gingerbread house while doing this, but due to the circumstances, I am just gonna give y'all the video. So today might be a little shorter than other days because I actually am occupied today, but I'm going to read y'all off the experience, um, what they have. I'm gonna read a, a what is this? A job post? A job offering? Whatever. I'm going to read y'all the requirements for it. It says, education slash experience. You must have completed a formal nurse's aid course or must have a medical assistant certification. That's what I got. Or must be currently enrolled in an accredited school of professional nursing and must have documentation of basic fundamentals of nursing from the school or must be a graduate from an accredited school of nursing or must successfully complete the hospital's eight-week job specific training program so off bat um i could easily scratch off two of those Okay, sorry y'all, like I was saying, I am babysitting, so you know, I do have a job to do, preoccupied, baby comes first, so this is kind of going to be cut up, but the certification, registration, and licensure that they want you to have, you have to have a current CPR course card, either completed within 90 days of hire, or um, after you get the job, which I already have, and then must be able to demonstrate basic patient care skills and skills in the use of supplies and assigned equipment, which anybody with a brain can do that. Not anybody, but you know what I mean. Must be able to communicate effectively with personnel of other departments, nurses, physicians, patients, and family, and must be able to demonstrate patient-centered, patient-valued behaviors. So that is the skills that they were looking for. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Like this is all that they're asking for to be a PCT. I didn't know before you could go to school or had to go to school to PCT. I literally did not go to school for PCT. So no, I did not go to school for PCT. Did not go back for anything. Sorry, the lightning here. I have to keep playing with it because I'm not on my camera and I'm not used to filming on this anymore. But yeah, like I literally didn't do any of that. I got it solely based on, I guess, me having um, a medical assistant certificate. I thought it said that you had to have, or you could have like so much of patient care, like six, six months of patient care, which obviously I have three years too. So I thought that's what got me in. But no, after reading these requirements, I'm pretty sure it was my medical assistant certificate. So yes, that is how I became a PCT for everyone who wants to know. I don't know if it's like that at every job. I don't know. I don't know. That's what happened for me, personal. So yes, so finally answering that question. And yeah, this will probably be the ending of this video because um, I'm babysitting and if you know how that goes, then you know. And it's really hard because I have filmed this like five times. The baby is finally asleep. So yes, but like it's too much to keep filming and coming back. So I'm just gonna tell y'all night. This is probably the longest, I mean shortest video I've ever had, but I am doing stuff. So yeah, that comes first. So yeah, I will see you guys tomorrow later. Um, how many days after? Ooh, tomorrow we will have five days till Christmas. Five days. So today is day six. We have six days, not day six, but we have six days till Christmas. So yeah, I will see you guys tomorrow later. I love you. Bye. Bye.
Bye. Bye. Bye. Bye. Bye. Bye. Bye. Bye. Bye. Bye. Bye. Bye. Bye. Bye. Bye. Bye. Bye. Bye. Bye. Bye. Bye. Bye. Bye. Bye. Bye. Bye. Bye.